Hey guys, how's it going? So today I wanted to take a look at a weapon that I got pretty recently, and uh, this weapon is really unique, even over all the legendary weapons I've gotten, because it has three damage types. Now this weapon is called the Irradiated Plasma Rifle, and as you can see on the damage tab, it has ballistic energy and radiation damage. And you can kind of tell this weapon wasn't even meant to be in the game, uh, because the damage stat there is actually covering the entire picture of the weapon. Um, so this type of thing wasn't really augmented to be in the game. So just because of that, I think this is a pretty cool weapon. It's really unique. I've never seen any other weapon, even legendary weapons, with three damage types. And uh, the other combination you could have is ballistic energy and poison damage, if this was the Poisoner's Plasma Rifle. And also I just want to mention that usually plasma rifles have ballistic and energy damage equal to each other. So this weapon should have 157 energy damage as well as ballistic damage. But I'm actually wearing a special piece of uh, power armor called the Tesla armor. And I have three pieces of these. And it actually says that the armor increases energy damage. Alright, so we're here at the Quincy Ruins and I'm just going to go and test the weapon. There's plenty of high-level enemies here to test it on, so... We're gonna see if it's any good. I uh, upgraded this weapon to the sniper rifle form, the overcharged sniper rifle. And yeah, it does quite a lot of damage. So it has a pretty small mag size, but a ton of damage per shot. Oh, there he is. If you count the ballistic and energy damage, Let's see, it has 157 Ballistic, and... Oh, these guys are rushing me. And 181 Energy Damage, that's about 330 damage per shot. And then you have the Radiation Damage, which isn't quite similar to those damage types. They don't do damage to the health bar, necessarily. But yeah, this is... It's a pretty good weapon. I really hate these, uh... Saltrons. Oh, that's strange. I had the option to hack it. Yep, get out of my face. But yeah, pretty good weapon so far. Oh, legendary. Okay. And with the help of my legendary Tesla armor, looking pretty cool on my power armor, I'm actually doing more energy damage, like I said. Kind of funny story about that, I had it in a uh, chest for a super long time, and then I looked in that chest a couple days ago and I found it, and I hadn't even read the legendary perk. And uh, that was when I was making my laser musket video, the 6600 laser musket video, and uh, I thought it would be cool to see if it actually increased the energy damage, which it did. So. That was pretty cool to see that actually happen. There we go. So yeah, pretty solid performance by this weapon. I'm not really sure how exactly to show you guys the radiation damage um, because 50 points of radiation damage takes away 5% of the enemy's total health bar, but that's only if they're not irradiated themselves. Kind of like ghouls are healed by radiation, so that wouldn't work on them. But basically you just find an enemy that's pretty tough, and you shoot them 20 times with a radiation weapon, and if they die from the radiation, then it's not going to reduce their overall health to zero but it's actually just going to reduce their max health to zero, so their capacity is zero. So that's kind of how radiation works. And yeah, I think we've seen this weapon is pretty good, pretty solid performance there. Can definitely handle itself with a lot of tough enemies around. So yeah, that was the Irradiated Plasma Rifle, a pretty unique legendary weapon. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you support the video by liking and sharing. And as always, thanks for watching.